you, master. What the hell are you? You know who I am. Virolakas, prince of the undead. So we are talking about the movie Club Dead. This movie seems to be a love letter to the 80s horror films, in particular one called Vamp, which was released in 1986 and starred Grace Jones. So Club Dead basically focuses on a group of friends, all of whom work in this kind of uh, cafe, basically, a bunch of waiters and stuff, and um, this new girl basically is, is kind of starts working there and they decide to go try and get into this club and for months they've been trying to get into this club and never seem to be getting it's very exclusive and everything like that but with one night this kind of this this girl comes in out of them for the first time somehow they've managed to get in but it's all as not as it seems as this club appears to be uh, basically hosted by a bunch of vampires who want to feast on the blood of the innocent so that's pretty much your premise of this movie very like uh, very much like the movie vamp like i've mentioned so what's it like i gotta say this is a very low budget campy film and not to the point where it's fun there's a scene here where a vampire attacks one of our kind of uh, victims and i literally thought oh this is going to be the guy who's just happened to be dressed up as a vampire and it's going to be like a, like a false lead and it's not this guy is literally going to be a vampire it looks so ridiculous now, uh, obviously it's a lower budget film, so you kind of got to give, you know, some leeway, I would say, with kind of lower budget movies. So with that in mind, we'll talk about some of the positives that I kind of liked about this movie. They are kind of limited. Uh, first and foremost, I would say the cast here all make somewhat likeable characters and kind of uh, somewhat believable friends as well. I actually quite liked some of their kind of like uh, the little quips that they had and kind of the back and forth that some of them had seemed quite genuine to me they seem like a kind of fun bunch of characters that you're kind of invested in and kind of like following through this kind of adventure so that's pretty much going to be my uh my positive here and my other positive this film isn't offensively bad i would say uh but that's pretty much it so it's the storyline is very basic it literally is this kind of um these guys just going into this club and it being a bunch of vampires there's not really it's not really any deeper than that we're led to believe that there's kind of a deeper mythology with this kind of like this old guy who runs this kind of like um convenience store who basically warns the kids and he seems to have some kind of like past kind of uh, connection with this kind of vampires and things like that but the story is very basic the execution is just is just very poor and very cheap the kind of the like uh, the kind of the main female vampire really struggles to talk with her kind of fangs and she's got this like massive lisp it's quite amusing basically when she's kind of talking and the vampire makeup is a, is a mixed bag the, uh, the ironic thing here is some of the kind of the more background vampires seem to look a little bit more effective uh but you have some of these kind of like oh, what they call hero vampires which are kind of ones that have a bit more screen time look really crap especially the one other one i was talking about so you know it's it's a very poor film there's not a lot to it there isn't well and the, what we do have isn't very well executed i have to say so much so that it's just i don't know it's just a little bit of a struggle to sit through to ability there's not there's not a really a lot i can kind of tell you oh yeah this is good for this reason like i said it's not offensively bad it's it's kind of very lightweight and sort of forgettable if you just want a kind of a dog cheap vampire film then then you make it like it and like i said it's not going to offend anyone so props to that i guess but other than that i really struggle to have much in say in the way to say a positive of this film it is just uh a very poor attempt in vampires you can do for very cheap i would you know i don't know why they've kind of almost overdone some of the makeup sometimes and not to any positive effects here and like it's just so unsubtle i mean club dead come on i mean come on it doesn't even look that fantastic when you get inside <laughs> jesus anyway so uh i'm only gonna give this movie 2.5 out of uh, 10 i really can't give it any higher than that Anyway, check it out if you like your vampire films, cheap and nasty. Let me know what you think, and I'll look forward to seeing you next time. Bye for now.